Hey guys, so today I'm finally doing a what I eat in a day video. Mind my hair because it's so oily and I'm actually filming a hair video today, so it'll be better later on in the video. <laughs> this video is actually sponsored by Perfectal. I'm trying their hair crush gummies, so I'm going to keep you guys up to date with my journey on these. Yeah, let's just jump straight into the video. I actually can't function throughout the day without coffee. So there's two types of coffee that I like to make. Well, not make, this is just already made. That is the brand, it's their cold brew almond coffee. I think it's got extra shot on coffee and it's so good. I definitely recommend this. I tried the mocha one, I don't really like it. There's too much chocolate in it. This is just like a nice cold coffee. Oh my god, that's just like the best coffee. So we do use a coffee machine. Oh, we've got two. I don't really use this one. The others do, but I like this one. The coffee that I use is this Starbucks Columbia one. Well, I actually have it with milk. I try to go for like semi-skimmed milk, um, but mostly like oats milk or coconut milk. I'm not a big fan of almond milk apart from this one. It's so weird. I know I said um, to look into intermittent fasting when you don't have breakfast, but I've kind of like gone away from that, but it did help me a lot to like control my eating and um, lose quite a bit of weight. I'm actually gonna make a smoothie today, but what I do like to have in the week is some bowl of oats. This is the original one. When I have the original, I put banana. A lot of you said to try it with like um, chocolate and stuff, which you can. But I do also really like the sweet cinnamon version, which I just have on its own. But I'm not gonna have that today because I literally have it all week. I just bring a sachet to work and have it on my desk. Okay, this is a Tefal blend force. It's actually my sister's. She got it for her birthday, but I'm using it today. I hope you don't mind. So we're gonna put some bananas, strawberry frozen fruits, some mango frozen fruit, oat milk. And I'm gonna pop some chia seeds in there. We got this from Amazon. I've made some for everyone and this is what this movie lo looks like. I love this because it blends it literally like a slushy. Look how lush that looks. I'm gonna use my metal straw. Okay, so that's my breakfast done. I'm gonna go do my filming now and I will be back later on. All right guys, so it's now around 11 and I like to just have a snack because I get so hungry in between. So it really depends. Sometimes I just have a fruit, um, but I've been liking these lately. These are the M&S fruit and nut mix. You have jumbo raisins, cranberries, almonds, cashews, pecans, and pistachio. So I'll just have a bunch of these because, I don't know, it, it satisfies my sweet tooth and it's just yummy. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit for lunch. I've already started putting the chicken in the oven. So for lunch, next to my chicken, I'm gonna have some of these Mediterranean vegetables and some mushrooms mixed with it. These are really quick, they are frozen, but they're really quick to make. Alright guys, this is my lunch. I know it's huge, but my lunch is the biggest meal of the day. I try to go lighter in the evening for sure. I'm now also going to take my Perfecto Hair Crush gummies. Now that I'm a bit more careful and conscious of what I'm putting in my body, I do want to um, help my body from within. Phytobiotics are the number one supplement brand in the UK, and these vitamins have no artificial sweeteners. They're vegan. Overall, there's 21 carefully selected nutrients in these and there's stuff to help maintain your nails your skin definitely keep you guys updated with how i get on with them you can have two to three a day but it's really important to have it with a good main meal it says here that you have zinc to help maintain normal hair biotin to help maintain normal skin and selenium to help maintain normal nails so i'm going to go enjoy my lunch and have these vitamins and i'll see you guys later for another snack guys i completely forgot to mention i do make sure that i have a lot of water so i try to have one or two no two of these a day if i can but that just means you go to the loo a lot but it's okay it's worth it in the end um this is 700 ml so i usually stay around like 1.5 liters a day but if i'm really good or if i'm really feeling really crap i can do two late liters but that's what i will aim for but you have to make sure you drink a lot a lot of water before i never drunk water like i could go weeks without drinking water it was always juices coke no drink your water guys 
and it's really helpful to get one of these water bottles so you can keep track and I prefer a straw because it just makes drinking so much easier for me and yeah I thought it was really important for me to put this in there how can I forget like this is the main thing guys so it's now around like 3 30 so I am going to um snack on a fruit I'm gonna have an orange like every day I don't really snack in the afternoon unless I'm really hungry I'll have my fruit and nuts or I have fruit I want to get almond butter because I've heard like almond butter and like apple or banana is really good I'm probably gonna get a good one from Whole Foods though like an organic sugar free one and then I've heard like cinnamon and non-apple from you guys so I'm gonna try that but let me know in the comments below what your favorite snack is like healthy snack I need to know Is it just me that loves um, orange? Oh my god, there's nothing better than a good orange. Okay, so it's now almost seven and I'm gonna start the meal prep. I'm gonna show you guys what I use to like prepare for the whole week. I first use some uh, chicken breast. I cut this up into like cubes because it's just quicker to like cook as well. And um, I do marinate. I'll show you what I use to marinate. And then we we actually use um, some frozen vegetables. This is the stir fry. We actually really like this. I'm trying the Mediterranean vegetables. This has got like courgettes, um, peppers, aubergine. I also really like this butternut squash chunks. I put these in the oven and I like to fry it with um, sweet corn and a bit a bit of paprika. I know it's so random, but it's really yum. Here's some more chicken. We also get these. These are like massive boxes for like £10 and we just cut it all up. Put them in little like sachets and freeze them. These are the spices we use. This is char grilled chicken, garlic, herbs. And then sometimes I use these Nando's one, but they are not the healthiest of the healthiest. But I still put them in because, you know, they're really good. Okay guys, these are my meal preps done. I have a few Christmas dinners at work, so I haven't done like the full full week, but this will cover most of the week. Um, and yeah, it's just like little bit of chicken. I put more vegetables than chicken because I just prefer that. And I put some um, Brussels sprouts because I love them. And yeah. When well, I've chucked in um, our coriander, we actually freeze them, so we just they're just ready to go. You don't need to wash them or anything. Makes it really convenient. Then you just want to mix that through and trust me guys do this with your baked beans and then thank me later because this is so yummy it makes it so much better than plain old baked beans on toast do you guys like your scrambled egg like creamy or like well cooked because i don't like it when it's creamy so that's my dinner guys don't i look so yum I'm going to go have my dinner and probably go to bed because I've got work tomorrow. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more what I eat in a day videos. And subscribe if you're new to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.